Okay, so a quick intro. I have, uh, let's see, I think you pronounce it Yuffie. Uh, a Robovac L70 hybrid. And <clears throat> this is one of the friends. Uh, this vacuum uh, was doing its job, but they have uh, a little dog. And the little doggy was a little sick. And the Robovac didn't know. And it went to clean it up. So now I am getting a hard fault of uh, drops. Please uh, clean drop sensor. I will show it in just a moment. Okay, so what I did was I taped the wheels down so that the robot thinks it's down on the ground. Um, so that I can turn it on. And... Let's see. I'm trying to wake it up. There we go. Okay, so it's checking the light sensors. And floor uneven. See what it does now. Please wipe the bottom anti drop sensor and restart me in a safe place. Do Please it. wipe the bottom anti drop sensor and restart me in a safe place. So it's wanting you to wipe the anti drop sensors and uh, restart it. So I'm going to leave it on just for the time being and let's see, uh, these are the anti-drop sensors. You have four of them on this unit and what they are for is if it comes to like a stairwell or something and it sees that it's uh, uh, going to fall, that's what anti-drop. I thought it meant for... Uh, uh, water, but no, it's so that the unit doesn't fall off of uh, a staircase or stairwell uh, or something. So anyways, this is just an intro to it. Uh, I'm going to check these sensors and then uh, we'll tear it apart. I'll show you how I check them real quick. Okay, so infrared light cannot be detected by the human eye, um, but it can be picked up by a camera. So what I wanted to do was I just want to see... I taped them again, uh, that way it senses that it's on uneven uh, ground, and then uh, hopefully it'll keep these lights on long enough that I can check each one. So here we go, I'm going to wake it up. Uneven. There we go. So let's see, I saw this one flash. There it is. Let me shut the light off. Now let's see this one. Floor uneven. Please re floor uneven. Please restart me on an even surface. That floor one's on. Uneven. Please restart me on an even surface. That floor one worked. Uneven. Please restart me on an even surface. Let's see. I've got too much. I've got my blinds open. That one Floor worked. Uneven. Please restart me on an even surface. Floor uneven. That Floor one. Uneven. Please I just want to make sure that they're all kind of getting the same Floor brightness. Uneven. They are. Uneven. Please restart me on. Floor Let's see if I can uneven. pick up that beam a little bit better. There it is. Okay, so all our sensors are working. I'm going to take them off, clean them, uh, clean the lens. But yeah, I want to be extremely careful because this is plastic. It might scratch easy. Uh, so what I'll probably do is uh, maybe gently. Uh, I've got a, clean, a really clean dish here, no dust or anything. I'm going to use some uh, soapy water.
uh, Dawn dish soap. Cuts oil down real good. And then I will rinse it with uh, water and I'll blow dry it with uh, compressed air. Uh, that way I can at least get my lenses clean. And then what I'll probably do is a hard reset after that. Um, so maybe disconnect the battery. Make sure that there's no internal battery or capacitor that keeps memory.
so I want to make a quick video real quick we're having problem with our uh, drop sensors um, I should have made a video I already cleaned it off but we had some corrosion on this uh, sweeper motor and you can see down in there where it makes contact on the bus bar there's some corrosion so I just want to make a note of that well anyways I was going to pull my circuit board off and when I went to disconnect my uh, anti-drop sensors from the circuit board there is corrosion so that's probably why we're losing contact with our uh, drop sensors just want to make a special note of this wanted to uh, try this out let's see okay connected and I think if we hold it oh, see what she does see if she'll take off I don't know what
Well, I guess there it is. I'm going to call it good. Give it uh, maybe a minute or so. That's pretty cool. Fantastic. So I'm going to say this one's done. Anyways, thank you for looking, anybody that watched. Have a wonderful day.